Top Hamas leader killed. Gaza ceasefire hangs in balance. Israel's strike on Beirut. Here are some of the top developments from the Middle East. Assassination of Ismail Haniya. Ismail Haniya, the Qatar-based public face of Hamas, was assassinated in Iran in what might mark a defining moment in the ongoing war between Israel and the Palestinian militant group. Haniya was killed in Tehran, where he had gone to attend the inauguration of the newly elected Iranian president Masoud Pezakeshkian. Israel strikes Beirut. The alleged assassination comes after Israel targeted a Hezbollah commander in Beirut on Tuesday, with fears growing about a major regional escalation in conflict. An Israeli airstrike targeted a senior Hezbollah commander in Beirut's southern suburbs on Tuesday night following a rocket attack from Lebanon three days earlier that killed 12 children and teenagers. The strike caused a loud blast and visible smoke and its a target's fate remain unclear. Hezbollah denied involvement in the initial rocket attack. Global Condemnation of Hanie's Assassination Senior Iranian government and military officials have convened to discuss the country's response with a foreign ministry spokesperson saying Hanie's blood will never be wasted. The attack has been condemned by Turkey and Russia with Ankara labelling it heinous and Moscow calling it an absolutely unacceptable political murder. Palestinian Authority President Mahmoud Abbas has also condemned the assassination, describing it as a cowardly act and a dangerous development. Peace talks hang in thread. The Prime Minister of Qatar, who has acted as a mediator in ceasefire talks between Israel and Hamas, questioned the chances for negotiations to succeed following Hanie's murder. For more updates on the development in the Middle East, keep following our official YouTube channel as we bring you live updates and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Indian Express on YouTube.